wonderful beings in Sonko's worlds and interested in a vital shifting retreat here in the beautiful jungle. So this last theme is for leaders. Now, leaders of all kind, if you're an education or a thought leader or an executive, whatever, this is really about the integrity of leadership. So leader mana, mana is a word that comes from Maori. So here is my New Zealand connection. Not that I speak Maori, please. I don't want to give the wrong impression. But mana is a sense of power of integrity. So the integrity is the key in this word. So if you feel that it's time to take your leadership to the next step, then it's really like for those of you who can imagine to take the egocentric leader into the authentic and the ecocentric leader, ready for a global shift in harmony with yourself, with others and with nature. So if you can imagine that, then either you already have the courage or you feel it inside and you really want to be that leader in the world. What would be your current situation and your challenges? Well, leadership can be a lonely road at times. And sometimes it's filled with many expectations and pressure from others. So being creative, intuitive, correct and authentic and compassionate is not always an easy place for you. So you're trying to meet deadlines, you're trying to constantly come up with some new ideas, keep people engaged, have good relationships and serve the world can sometimes be not only a, role, a lonely road, but also a very challenging and difficult. So in that, you may experience some pain, some conflict, dilemmas and breaking points. So it could be, for instance, that sometimes you lose the sight of what is truly happening around you because the pressure is just too much. And it seems like sometimes you're running out of options. You are relying on what you have done in the future. You are reading what is possible. You have all kinds of theories at your hand, but maybe your stress levels are too high. Maybe your creativity is asleep. Maybe you're not in a happy state of being for you to truly be the leader that you would like to be. Your sleep might be compromised and you feel a lot of pain in your physical body, in your emotional body. And maybe you're in a space where you worry a lot. So that shift of your current situation and your pain and conflict often also includes dilemmas. So really ethical situation where you don't know what is right and wrong. So how can we help with this? How can we be of service in your next step, your new horizons and this extraordinary version of yourself? being this wonderful integrity with your leader within. So we will help you here to de-stress first, to get rid of the tension, your ordinary life, so that we can come in a space where we can actually help you to connect to your truth and your integrity. We're gonna help you to find your current calling to lead, your sacred dream, and we're gonna have a good look at ethical development for you. And of course, your courage, if it's already awakened, we're going to help you to direct it where you feel you would like to take it. And if you haven't awakened it yet, well, we are here to help you to find that courage of the heart to be the true leader that you are and want to be. We take you on a journey for stepping up and stepping out and stepping beyond to get really clarity on where you are going and where your new horizons can take you. So your manner is the guide to be that extraordinary leader that you can be. Again, we have a beautiful Zoom call and we figure out the details for your personal retreat. And again, it includes whatever you're ready, a vision quest, ceremonies, movement, wherever it takes us to take you to the next step in your life as a leader. 
We'll be very happy to see you on retreat and very happy to share the beautiful jungle space of Anakaspi with you.